Now to our other top story for new measures to crack down on the spiking number of overdose overdose deaths involving drugs laced with fentanyl. Seven suspected drug dealers in Orange County now face stiffer charges than just selling narcotics. They're accused of selling fentanyl that killed someone. KCAL 9's Orange County reporter Michelle Geely is live in Garden Grove with a look at the cases and the federal charges. Michelle. Christine, that's right. Three friends who died on Balboa Island last October have now been added to the list of fentanyl related deaths here in Orange County. Today, the DEA and the U.S. Attorney announced that a Costa Mesa man has been arrested for selling them fentanyl laced cocaine, and the task force has announced even more charges. Seeing my son's body put on a stretcher and then putting a bag over him and zipping him up. Seal Beach's Perla Mendoza lost her only child, 20-year-old Elijah, to fentanyl poisoning. The investigation revealed that the pills he bought from a dealer he met on Snapchat were laced with the powerful and deadly drug. And he ended up um, purchasing what he believed to be Percocet. And um, those Percocets were 100% fentanyl. There was zero Percocet in that pill. The dealer has not been caught. Law enforcement has told Elijah's mom that he may be connected to other fentanyl deaths in Orange County. They sell fentanyl because it is cheap. We regularly see instances uh, in which a street level dealer continues to sell drugs after learning that their product has killed someone. Today, federal authorities announced charges against seven men who were accused of distributing fentanyl, resulting in the deaths of 10 people in Orange County. The alleged dealer in a recent case that killed three friends on Balboa Island last October has been arrested. If you are a recreational drug user, you are at risk of a fentanyl caused death. If you are someone just experimenting with drugs, you are at risk of a fentanyl caused death. In Orange County, fentanyl is the leading cause of death for kids 17 and under. This seizure of 200 pounds of fentanyl made by the Orange County Sheriff's Department this year was enough to kill every resident in the county. Orange County has had a consistent increase in fentanyl related deaths over the last several years. Since 2016, it's been a 1,600% increase. In 2019, 34% of all drug related deaths in Orange County involve fentanyl. The next year, that number nearly doubled to 64%. And in 2021, fentanyl was linked to 74% of Orange County's drug fatalities. And Christine, the latest figures from the Orange County coroner show that 695 people in Orange County were killed in the year 2021. These are fentanyl related deaths. I should also add that these dealers, if in fact they're convicted, face a mandatory minimum prison sentence of 20 years. That's the latest live in Garden Grove. I'm Michelle Geely. Back to you.